perfect for them are heat exposure and cold exposure. Uh, I was just going. I was just going, just going there there? because we've all seen. Maybe we haven't all, but you will soon because it's a thing. It's a fad, right? On TikTok and Instagram, oh, the right cold now, plunges? the cold plunges. Yeah. Um, so, and, and that's exactly what it's doing. It's it's creating that stress for the body, and actually, so we've heard recently because we don't have a cold plunge. I'd like to get one. Really? Yes. But you can do this by dipping your face in cold ice water. So mm -hmm. the same, there's the face has so many receptors. So, you know, the point is cold shower. If you don't have a cold plunge, you could still create some of these effects with what you do have. Absolutely. And then with heat exposure, that would be like sauna, yeah. right? Um, infrared sauna at its, it, it is the highest. That's kind of like my favorite type. It's really good if you can do back to back, like a sauna session and then jump in an ice bath or, uh, ice cold, like a cold shower. Right. Because you're no, it's it. Yeah, no, I, know, I know, but it is, it is really good for yeah, your nervous you system. Ever get the chance to go to one of those spas that Remember has we the, did that in Iceland. Yeah. That has the pool. Like they'll have I a cold plunge. As as you. I did not appreciate that. I mean, I appreciated it, but you got right in that cold plunge. It was so refreshing. I think I can't do a cold shower. I mean, there's just like, that's just like miserable. I feel like there's something I don't know. It goes, very, it goes very deep yeah. for me, but I can, I want to get one of those cold plunge pools and I've seen them, you know, you could buy them. They're very expensive where you get, basically they look like a bathtub and my husband, I showed it to my husband. I was like, oh, you know, cause he likes it's like a metal base that you keep outside, like an old yeah. bathtub. And he's like, fill up the bath and put in some ice. Well, yes, that's exactly like, it. Oh, shoot. But these are like portable ones that you would put outside. And that's the thing. You don't want to go through the trouble necessarily. You don't want to use all the ice. You can't get it cold enough. So if you do have, they're portable. So they right. seem like they're more affordable. Right. That's an option. Yeah. I just can't, to me that I know it's so good for you, but I just, <laughs> I can do the cold shower and in the summer I'll jump in the lake, which is still not that cold, but at least it's like that's after great. you've that's worked great. out and you've had, you've sweat and then you jump in the shower. It's the shock. But, yeah, it's shocking your system a little bit, but th this is a sidetrack, but this is, I haven't told you this yet, but when we were college touring, we were, at, our first stop was North Carolina. We were in Raleigh and we stayed at a absolutely beautiful, you would have loved it. The, the resort, like not resort, I guess, hotelish that we stayed at, but in the morning, so I washed my face the night before, no issue in the morning, I get in the shower. Okay. Hot shower. And I look down and I've been in there for like five minutes. I look down and everything is brown. The water and it's just dripping. I was like, am I bleeding? Did I get like, sorry, TMI, but like, do I have my period? Like, what is happening? But it just kept coming. I was so like, I'm like it's great. I, I didn't know about. Right. Yeah. I was like, what is in my, like, what is happening? Is the color coming out of my hair? And so finally I was like, it's the water. Oh, you were flipping out. I was, you know me. I was like, <laughs> I'm toxic. What oh, is it? No. I'm doomed. Like the world is <laughs> So I called Ken. I was like, Ken, look at this water. And he was like, first of all, don't panic because North North Carolina, it's yeah. clay. And North Carolina yeah. is known for that. So, so anyway, he's, and he was messing with the sink. He goes, it's only the hot water. He said, turn it to cold. So I turned the cold on and sure enough, it stopped. So anyway, I've been, I got back in. I was like, I'm rinsing all this off me because I don't know what's in it. So I, but the reason I'm telling you this story is then Ken had to get a shower and you guys may not know my husband, but he's a big guy <laughs> and he is not into cold exposure or sauna. He like he's not home, trying, that day. <laughs> not trying to get some more it, Not necessarily here. videoed him in the shower, but just if you could have heard him. <laughs> So ridiculous but it's like ken this is so good for your sister he's like you know did not want to hear that <laughs> but anyway it is cold exposure is a good it's, it is and that's why you're hearing about it all over yeah. it stems from this yeah. topic.